Lord of the Rings and Goonies star Sean Astin was asked by TulsaWorld.com recently about the much talked about potential Goonies 2 and where the project stood. Astin gave the following thoughts. I have said and will always say that it's not a question of if, but rather of when the sequel gets made. The precise makeup of it, I have no idea. Whether I will be in it, no idea. Whether they would even want the original cast in it, no idea. But it doesn't matter. It's bigger. It's actually bigger than everybody. It's bigger than even Steven Spielberg, who created it. It's bigger than Richard Donner, who breathes such strong life into it. It's now a part of American culture lore, and the studio has a lot to gain from promoting it. So you can take it to the bank that people will get to enjoy it more. Mark, Byron said that we will ever see a Goonies 2. You drive a hard bargain, Ash, because I would easily buy that we're going to see another Goonies incarnation of some kind. Mm-hmm. Now, I th- I'm starting to lean more towards that we're going to get a reboot than we would a sequel called Go- Goonies 2. I'm still going to buy it just by a hair because I think it's just such an easy story to come up with where, oh, now the Goonies, the original Goonies are now parents and they have kids that are going to go on their adventure. That story still makes so much sense to me, but the further we get away from the original Goonies, the more I I think that we might just get a reboot altogether, which I, I I didn't grow up on the Goonies. I saw it when I was in college and I loved the movie, but it wasn't a part of my childhood. So I wouldn't love the fact that we're rebooting Goonies. I think I'd rather see a sequel. At this point, I'm leaning more towards uh, just a total reboot than I was before. Well, I'm going to sell it because of the same reasons. I think they are more likely to reboot this series right. for a younger generation versus having a sequel. I mean, this is one of those things kind of like Ghostbusters where they kept talking about it and talking mm, about it and talking right. about it, and then eventually Ghostbusters got rebooted. I think Goonies will get rebooted as, as opposed to a sequel because, I don't know, just getting all that whole cast back together. Chunk, have you seen Chunk? He looks he's, nothing He's bald like- and muscular now, and he's a lawyer. He, he doesn't even act Which anymore. works great yeah. for the Goonies, too. <laughs> like that's You could not write a better story for Chunk. <laughs> and Goonies was part, fake laughs. And Goonies was a part of my childhood. I watched yeah. it when I was younger, and I watched it like mul- You know, when you're a kid, you watch movies like multiple, multiple, multiple times. I right. think I saw it like when I was a kid, probably like 10, 15 times, just like watching it over and over. I saw the Goonies just this year. Wow, that was that was one of those movies really? that, that when you mention like, there's always your friends. Yeah. You're like, you didn't, you haven't what? You haven't seen that X movie? Come on, and people are like, yeah, I just haven't had time to see. It. That's one of the I just missed that one movie. Yeah. What? And, you, and then you do they claim that. that you don't watch any movies whatsoever because no. you missed that Only one movie? Only a few people love to claim that, yeah. and there are fans. But um, <laughs> yeah, uh, I eventually I saw it this year, and I really loved it. I mm-hmm. loved the Goonies. But that makes me sell this idea. Mm-hmm. Like I feel like having a sequel to the Goonies is going to do more harm than good because then you have all this backstory. Like, what are the original Goonies doing now as opposed to just having a brand new adventure and following the kids? Because that's what the Goonies was about. It wasn't about the parents. It was about the kids. So if you do a Goonies sequel with all of that baggage of like having a you know, explain o vision everything for like the first 20 minutes. And actually, you'd have to give all the original actors more screen time because mm-hmm. they, you know what I mean? Like, if it was a sequel, there would be that like extra weight of like, he hasn't had enough, he should be in it for 10 minutes or whatever. I, I would actually rather see a reboot. Yeah, I'm still going to have bought it, but you guys make a great argument. And Dennis, you brought up Ghostbusters where they could reboot Goonies <laughs> and still have a tiny role mm-hmm. for right. Sean Astin or Josh Brolin or sure. whoever else wants to come back from the original cast. The kid who played Short Round. Right, right. The muscular, bald uh, uh, chunk. (laughs) <laughs> well, and also the problem too is the the whole story of Goonies is about let's say we do a, they do a sequel and they have the original cast come back and it's their kids. The whole point of Goonies is the venture of the kids getting away from the parents, right. doing all this stuff without them. So if if they were to do it, they would only probably be in the beginning or or the end of it. Yeah. A- Ashley, uh, have you seen the original Goonies? I probably saw it. Um a million years ago and I didn't really care for it. Maybe I just like, I I wasn't into it. I mean, like I was probably really young and it didn't stick with me. So, I mean, so I'd probably rather have a reboot just to kind of get like a new take on it Mm -hmm. because I, I didn't grow up with it either. If you had me at the end of this, Mark, (laughs) I'm going to kill you. (laughs) (laughs) 